Where are you heading, Tim? <laughs> to lab. Why are we going to lab? Because I need to label some stuff for when I'm leaving. Right now, we're gonna go to lab and we're gonna have a fun time labeling. This Sam, is what we do on a Saturday. Sam hasn't been to lab in, I'm guessing, at least six months. Probably two years. Actually physically inside the lab, at least a year. Yeah, that is true. I don't do lab work anymore. I prefer it that way. Okay, so we're labeling peach juice plates. So I will take you along on how labeling works. Now we're in the infamous stocking hall where all grad students come to cry. This is where I cried a lot. Same. <laughs> you need exclusive access, so you need to <laughs> so show them, show them, show them. Let me close this again. Not anymore. Okay, let's check if my ID works anymore because I do not come here anymore. It works. I'm allowed in. Come in. Now you have to go up the stairs. He's demonstrating how you walk. <laughs> we immediately go to the elevator because I refuse to take the stairs. We are waiting for the elevator. Thank you. you you're getting the hang of this. What do you love the most about grad school? Um, I can't really think of anything right now. Because there's nothing to love. Don't go to grad school. The people that I've met. You love me. That work in the lab. You love me. And this is him professing his love to me right now. That is not what's happening. <laughs> professing my friendship to multiple people and you just happen to be here. This is the office. This is my desk. Why is there a box on my desk? What's in here? Oh! So I have two water bottles, then a mug, then two more bottles, and then one more bottle over there, because I'm a bottle fiend. Then I have things and papers that I have not touched in the last year and a half. If we walk over here, we have Tim's desk. Whoa, your monitor! This it definitely is cooler than you, Tim. I know, it's awesome. Can you see it's curved? Yeah. Wait, why'd you get it in? Because I was tired of like trying to do multiple things in the tiny ass laptop. It's Alexa. She's beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? That is so awesome. This is a segment of let's see what's on Tim's desk. Here we have a crate of milk. We are both part of the MQIP at Cornell. It's a milk quality improvement program at Cornell. So we work with like dairy processing plants in New York and assess their milk, their, assess their quality, give them like, suggestions and stuff. And then these are milks. So a um, little debrief about milk. Chocolate milk comes from brown cows. So this is where this milk comes from. That is not true. Hopefully Sam has learned. Oh, look at that. We can watch my, oh, let's not watch my videos. But look. This is your most viewed video. I know it is. This is so long ago. Now me and Bob the Builder are going to the lab. Not Bob the Builder. You kind of look like Bob the Builder. You're wearing yellow. See, I'm not even sure he wears a yellow shirt. He wears a yellow heart hat. Now again, exclusive access. <laughs> VIP only. You need to be safe and put on goggles. He looks like a scientist. Is he a scientist? I don't know. <laughs> Hello, Tim. Sing us a song, Tim. Song. Baby, 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 baby. What is one thing you dislike about grad school? Myself. What? No, why? Because I create most of my own problems. Let's go get a lab coat, because I want to look cool. So usually the lab coats are here. I think I look so much cooler now. Don't you agree? Sing for me, Pablo. Sing for me, Pablo? What? Do you get the reference? No. Lizzie That's McGuire like movie. So here are the plates, and here are all these labels. We have these beautiful purple gloves that I miss so, so much. So we're just labeling things. I'm helping him label. It'll be fun. Bob the Builder is back. So the reason why we would want to like pre-label everything before we actually do the study or whatever we're working on is because it makes life so much easier. Whenever you're running something that's in the lab, you have to prepare for your study 
and that includes labeling things which is very joyous usually when i label things i have a podcast on and i'm just jamming to it so it's really not that bad and time goes by fast but sometimes you have studies where like you have a ton of stuff to like label and it's like not as fun but you get friends to help you so like here i'm helping tim because he has like sweat lab stuff to do and wet lab just basically means physically being in this lab. See ya! He's leaving me alone. We have the standard plate count, which you can kind of tell it's like on the yellowish side. We have the CVTA, which is on the purple side. Different plates allow for different organisms to grow because some plates have like ingredients in it that will inhibit some organisms. What are you labeling? Two ounce vials. And what's inside of them? Air. <laughs> Guess who's here? Wow. Sam's here. How are you? I am helping Tim label. Oh, cool. I was like fish out of water. I was like, is that? And that's Samantha. Yeah, why are you asking her why she's here? <laughs> I'm here almost this. every day. <laughs> so now we need more plates. So I'm gonna go to the media room. I have achieved the goods. Say hello to the vlog. Oh gosh. You want the dogs? <laughs> yeah. Right, hello friends. Here we have a taste test with Sam. So I got a holiday gift box. So I'm interested in these cookies. They're made by Sam, another Sam in our lab. So Sam, Sam, and another Sam. Mm. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is what they look like. It's like slivered almonds and then what's this cream? Is They're like a ginger snap? It's brown butter toffee sandwich cookies. Oh my god. They're really good. This is amazing. You want a cookie? So like good. That. What? Like yeah, this is fire. I don't like the nuts. I don't like you. So let's open the candy. Close your eyes and pick something from the back and you're gonna eat it. <laughs> Hold your eyes. You're gonna try it I, mean, for I the already know what this is though. Okay. Fine, fine. Pick something else. Chocolate and chocolate. Chocolate almond crunch, I'm not eating. This is sugar cookie, I will eat it. So, Tim is a very, very picky person. <laughs> what do you think? So it's supposed to be a sugar cookie, Hershey's Kiss, mm -hmm. but I think it absorbs some of the flavors from the other candy. Like it kind of tastes a bit like Reese's. Who likes Reese's? Me! Yours. Do you want a treat? Sure. Now we're heading to Poke Lobby to get Poke Balls. Tell the vlogs where you're from, Tim. Illinois. Really? Oh yeah. What's <laughs> where are you from, Sam? I'm from Maryland. 